What up, people? Welcome back to Hermitcraft. My name is Cub, and take a look at my shiny conch shell. Just got this from a drowned on this beautiful river, which we are still living on the banks of currently. Looking pretty nice. We still got the chicken farm going. We upgraded this to a double chest, so we now got a lot more eggs. Uh, we can offer people eggs in this trying time, so that's fantastic. Uh, I'm still looking for a place to live, still wondering if I should build a base or something. Right now, though, Second option for a base has emerged that is looking pretty good, honestly. Rendog has made a doghouse, and honestly, I'm thinking about unilaterally deciding to move into Rendog's basement, because why not? Uh, so, I think it would be funny if, like, maybe if we open this chest, right? If that chest opening opened, like, a piston here, and I could, like, drop down into, like, my base under Ren's small base here. That would be absolutely hilarious, I think. So, we might do that in a bit, but in the meantime, guys, I have been scheming, I have been plotting, and I have come up with what is perhaps the most diabolical plot of all time to take over the server and the rest of the world. Okay, maybe not that much, maybe not that diabolical, but still, I find it slightly humorous, so we're gonna do it. It's pretty simple. Here is the plan. Every crafting table we see, break it and replace with obsidian. Why? Because we can. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's do it. Of course, we got to do ourselves too. Otherwise, that would raise suspicion. So, bada bing, bada boom. Your crafting table is now a rock. <laughs> now, you might ask yourself, why are you replacing all crafting tables with obsidian? Well, I mean, there's not really a reason. Some men just want to watch the world burn. In that case... Uh, not really burn, but just be minorly inconvenienced for no apparent reason. I thought about actually making some signs and putting like... You messed up. And stuff like that. <laughs> all around, but... Eh, it's better if I just leave no trace of anything and just like... Do it for the sake of it. I think it's a lot funnier too. Uh, anyways, we gotta find all the crafting tables, replace them with obsidian. Honestly, 19 might not be enough. I might have to actually go and mine some more obsidian. Uh, luckily, I know exactly the place. Here's another one. It's farewell. Uh, we are going to do something with these crafting tables. Something constructive. Uh, in the name of helping the server. So, <laughs> yeah. Uh, just bear with me here. Let's just keep moving. Here's another one out here. And like I said, just replacing all crafting tables with obsidian. Just like, just like that. There we go. Tango is actually still online, so we gotta be quick about this. Looks like he was actually here earlier. Let's see, he might... Oh, there he is. He might have actually seen us. Well, hello there, sir. Hey, how are you? Hey, uh, you saw nothing here. Nothing happened here. <laughs> no, nothing at all. What's the no, matter? What are you no, doing? No, no. Shh, shh. <laughs> all will make sense when you return. Good luck. Okay. Good luck. All right. Well, I need my composters. All right. Good luck. Okay. I think we played that smooth. I think we played that smooth. Maybe not, though. Maybe not. No crafting anymore. Only mining. Only mining. There we go. And, wow, there's a lot that were left here. <laughs> Add that one. And this one. Bam. The best part of this little prank is that every time we now see a block of obsidian by itself somewhere on the server, we know. We know what has happened there. So, that's awesome. Anyway, onward to the next crafting bench. Of course, the crafting benches underground also got to be taken out. We don't know where all these crafting benches are, but all the ones we do find, we will take out. Just like that. Should probably also check the nether, I think. Maybe there's a couple of the people left there, or wanted to keep there. Wow, this is a tremendously bad spawn in the nether. Holy smokes. This actually might be good. We might actually want to stay here for a second. And maybe see if we can find other people's bases here via the nether bit. <coughs> Got, uh oh. Uh oh, we might be caught. We might be caught, guys. 
We might this yeah, we might be caught. Right, there's a portal over there, let's head over there. <laughs> Any idea what happened? Uh You know, now that you say something, it appears as if something has happened to mine as well. Hmm. <laughs> He's not buying it. He's not buying it at all, let's be honest. Random crafting bench abandoned in a waterfall that is slowly deteriorating? There we go. Hold up, hold up. Is that a pillar all the way up there on the very tip top of the mountain? You guys see that? It's definitely a pillar up there. That might be a crafting bench. We can't risk it. We gotta go up. We gotta go up. It is! It is a crafting bench! I knew it! You can spot a crafting bench from a mile away now, man. Wow. I am actually impressed with myself with that one. Alright, let's grab this. Goat, don't knock me off. Uh, what happened to it? Oh no, we lost it. Maybe I picked it up already. I'm really not looking to get hit off here, goat. Thank you. Thank you. Alright, let's get up here. Oh, there it is. We got it. Bang. And... Bang. Perfect. Much improved. Much improved. <laughs> Any other peaks nearby with the crafting bench on it? I don't think so, actually. Alright. Perfect. That is the ultimate accomplishment. I'm very happy we actually saw that from that far away. From the very summit of that peak all the way down to the very first crafting table placed here, I believe. Or what has to be close to the first crafting one placed. I think our mission here is now complete. Ye old community crafting center. Crafting together. That's right. We bought all the inconvenience of traveling to a new location with all the convenience of your ordinary crafting table. Now, to be clear, this is not any ordinary community crafting center, right? We have the floor made of community crafting tables. The walls made of community crafting tables. And to an extent, the ceiling made of community crafting tables and you can breathe that in and you can really feel the crafting that could take place here in the future. I mean, imagine you could have one player crafting here, two players crafting here, or dare I say three players crafting here, or perhaps as many as 40 players crafting here because that's how many crafting tables make up the entire thing. So 40 people crafting simultaneously, imagine the possibilities that exist within the confines of of these almost walls of crafting tables here. Magnificent. I can't wait to see how people make use of this. With the community crafting center now up and operational, it was now time to go mining for some resources. So we called up iJevin and decided to go on a dual caving mission. Jeff, can you hear that? I can, I absolutely can. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be hearing, but I hear it. Yeah, that's good. I, I was hoping you could hear the oars down there because I, I certainly can't. I certainly oh, can't. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely, definitely can hear them whispering to me. Yeah, you so. gotta pull your ear to the ground, and that's how mm. we find them. That's how we find them. So we're going mining, Jeff. Yes, we are gonna go mining. And we're gonna do all the fun stuff, and I just literally spent 45 minutes in the nether collecting quartz to get a Fortune 3 pickaxe. Right here, by the way. Ooh, so we're gonna be doing pretty good today. Take that sucker and look mm -hmm. at it. It doesn't mm -hmm. have unbreaking, Admire but I did get two of the two of the good ones. So very good. That's beautiful, man. That's beautiful. And I, I just I I just want to point out that I'm not a, f a friend of enchanting anymore. Me and me and enchanting <laughs> used to be besties. <laughs> did it take and take a little bit of time? A little bit of when time? I was cycling my iron enchant to get the fortune populated, I went from 21 levels to seven levels trying to get that. So oh. I was not happy that I had to spend all that effort to get it. Okay. Okay. Do we have not enough? Good. Do we have enough coal too? That's the other thing. Cause you can't get coal down low anymore. So, uh, I have twenty nine torches and a bunch of wood. That's it. So. Okay. I got I got some charcoal. Ren and I have yeah. been sort of like gathering charcoal. We're just gonna take a couple oh, out of bet, these furnaces bet. here. You know. There we not, go. Not gonna miss this stuff, Ooh. right? There we go. So that that'll work perfect. Awesome. Awesome. Sweet. Sweet. So we should we should um, head out. We should find. Do we yeah, have any which... any particular direction? Uh, any any way that you want to go is pretty much good to go. Okay, let's just go to the mountains over here and see if we can find a cave, man. Mm, sounds good. Sounds good. A lot, yeah. Watch out for the creeper <laughs> right above you. Oh my god! Ooh. My goodness. Mm. Hang on, hang on. 
Oh yeah. Problem solved. <laughs> yeah. There we go. It'd be great if we could find Sounds like a. Good. If we could find an ore vein, that would be really great. Yeah. Um, I suppose we should probably try to go down then. Yeah. Although, yep. oh man, I was really hoping to find some spore blossoms. I do see some over there, but oh, they're kind of far, yeah. high up. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we could try and make it. We could try and make it there. There's some lapis down there. Go okay. jump down. Yeah, let's drop down. Let's do it. Ooh, I should have probably ate food before I did that. <laughs> I'm gonna go over here for you know two seconds. Yep. Keep going this way then. Yeah, let's just keep going there's, this way. Uh, oh, there's gold right behind you. Keeps going down a little bit. Yeah, grab that. Oh, there's some as a geo here. Holy smokes. Oh, nice. Nice. Okay. I'm gonna grab a few of these. Yeah, me too. The block the builder in me is saying, hey, I need these. Yeah. I think it's the first one that I've actually seen too. I think yeah, I think so. This is the first one I've seen as well. I've seen a lot of calcite though. I'm just gonna mine this gold out here. I guess we can keep going down this this way. That's the good thing yeah, about these caves. Good. They're like they're like never ending caves here, pretty much. Yeah, I mean like even just one little section will, you know, lead into something crazy probably. Jeff, oh, is there's that, gold right here. Is too. that an ore vein? Do you see that up there? You see the copper bit? Hold on one second. Could, uh, oh, I think that, I Where think are you is. looking? See this right here? Oh, that is definitely an ore vein. Bingo, we got it, jackpot baby. So Let's so go. we doing copper ore? Cool, cool. Let's do it. Why not? Why not? Sure. Get all the copper. I almost wonder Get if we copper. should go across over here, like right here, because it looks like it goes up through the ceiling, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Good idea. Good idea. And I'll grab all this iron. Delicious. Light this up. Yeah. Maybe. Goes, yeah, oh, oh my God. Bit. Yeah. This is definitely an ore vein. Yeah. This is nice. All right. Let's we'll really see how much good. we get from this sucker. Yeah. We get tons. I'm guessing. I love the way that the vines look in this biome. Oh yeah, like light, yep. light green almost. Mhm. Mm oh, I just found a uh, raw iron copper block. Did you really? Wow. Or raw copper block, I should say. Nice. Copper that confirms and iron it. Aren't together? That yeah, definitely. It. No doubt now. We could literally sell this to the other builders on the server and become rich. Yeah, exactly, man. Exactly. There we go. Driven and I continued our quest into the caves, deeper into the world, mining redstone and gold and diamonds and every sorts of minerals that we could get our hands on. We crossed lava lakes, we fought creepers. It was a great time, and eventually we finally emerged back to the regular overworld, and we ran into somebody unexpected. Birch. Where, where are you set up? Is this where you're set up? Oh, here's, uh, here's oh, B-dubs. Oh, this is B-dubs, yeah. <laughs> Oh, oh! Let's uh, leave group. Hi. Yep. Hi. Hello, good hi. sir. Hey, hi. Hello. What's up? I come, hate. Come. I hate. I hate the shuffle, I, uh, shuffle. Should I? Should I give him a gift? Thing. Yeah. It would, make things, it would make things even. Make things even. There you go. There you go, buddy. Wow. Even we just from got done caving. We got done caving. Yeah, we went on yeah, caving we expedition. Yeah, we found sixty-three diamonds. So no way. Yeah. Yeah, baby. <laughs> I mean, and guys, like a ton of other stuff. You want some uh, spore blossoms? Yeah. There's uh, oh. two spore blossoms for you. Oh my goodness! Thank you. No problem. Cheers. Wow. Can I give I... you guys something? You want nope. watermelon seeds? Nope. No. Nope. <laughs> your 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 gifts are no good here. Ah, how about one of the most valuable resources on the server, coal? Uh. I'll, I'll take it's a piece. It's hard to find coal. We'll take I'll, coal. I'll take a piece. We'll take coal. Yeah, I'll take a piece. Here. Here is 11 and 10. Nice. nice. That's yeah. useful. Can't find that stuff anymore. Beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. yeah. Also, you can... I don't know where I got this, but you can... Check what? It. Oh, wow. So, that was First so shot. good. <laughs> oh, I got to save him. Yeah, you got to name him or something, man. He wants to go to your house. He's, you can have him. He's all yours. I nice. can? Okay, okay. I can't, I'm, I can't away. take the responsibility away. Of, a, of a chicken. No? I'm going to name him Samson. There you go. Come here. All right. Come here, Samson. All right. We're going to go uh, We're out, man. divvy up our spoils. <laughs> so see ya. Cheers. <laughs> okay. Bye. Thanks, guys. Bye. Right. There we go. You take the uh, name tag. I got one as well. Uh, already, oh, I have so. one in my inventory already. Okay, yeah. You, you, can, you can have that one because I already have another okay, one. Okay, cool. So. Perfect. 
cool. So I get all. Oh, this dude, stuff thank here. you for oh, the yeah. the invite. Good I appreciate stuff. it. Good stuff. And, yeah, this uh, is great, man. Yeah. If you ever want to go camping again, just hit me up. Or if you want to do some projects together, I'm totally down. Yeah, for so. sure, man. Yeah, appreciate awesome. it. Awesome. All right, I'm gonna go put all my stuff up. So see Same. you later, man. See you, man. Bye. Bye. Ladies and gentlemen, what an incredibly successful mining trip. We got 31 of the blues, 31 diamonds right there. Count them all. There you go. We also got a bunch of blocks of redstone, some blocks of raw copper, raw iron blocks. We got some drip leaves and spore blossoms from the lush caves, as well as gold and amethyst and, yeah, a couple other things you see in my inventory right here. So pretty successful haul. We're going to pick up these diamonds here. And we are going to store them in our new base area, which is actually Rendog's house, a.k.a. Uh, Rendog's basement, a.k.a. Cub's place. <laughs> so there we go. We'll put this stuff in here and store it away for safekeeping. We'll keep some of the food on us, I think. But really, really good haul with Jev. A lot of fun caving with Jev. And, yeah, now we're going to move on to something else. Okay, obviously one thing we got to do, we got to get a new sword, we got to get a new axe, and let's see, we already got a shovel and a pickaxe, so I think we're good on tools for now. We might want to upgrade our armor, so we might go ahead and make a diamond helmet, just like that. There we go, cover me with diamonds gotten. Uh, we can get a chest plate, some pants, and some boots, and there we go. Easy swap this stuff out put this stuff on and keep this as sort of a backup set now here in our base awesome what is that i see in your hand dude oh this is a golden carrot yeah 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 yep is it is that a is that a problem here or is like is that well you know i thought we we're going into the pie business oh yeah 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 what, what, what golden carrot what 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 golden carrots yeah 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 pies only pies only these here. are my grand this is my grandmama's recipe and everything come how oh, could you yeah. do me dirty like that dude no oh, that was my dude i found those and i was gonna like throw uh -huh. them in fire but i just didn't get around to yeah. it yet yeah that's what that's what's, right. what's up that's what's yeah. up dude you've been busy you've been busy i have been busy dude can you show now. me around because like I, I come in I, I log in today and it's like <laughs> bam there's a wheat field. There's a giant <laughs> giga factory of pies and such. Like, you got to show All me right. around this place, dude. You got to show, show you me around. around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is Giga Pies, right? Brought to you by Giga Corp. Beautiful. It's a beautiful, beautiful and, um, build here, man. Well done. Yeah, man. Oh, I goodness. added some uh, some wheat to try and, like, frame it a bit because it was sort of disappearing into the, the background. We have a really beautiful backdrop, but it sort of disappeared because of the block palette. So, sure. you know, the golden wheat sort of brings it up again. Yep. But come with me, Cub. Yeah, come yeah. with me. Let's go on the grand tour, baby. Let's see it. I Let's mean, see it. just a few days ago, this was nothing but the Cub Rain Rock. This was just a rock with a tree, and now it's more than that. It's more. It's a, it's a whole factory now. Man. <laughs> yeah, man. we got signs and everything. Oh, man. Okay. There's fancy signs. I like it. I like it. Ooh, yeah. Fancy So the way this too? thing works is man. you got the pumpkins getting farmed below. Okay. Okay. You got the chickens and the sugarcane being farmed at the same time automagically. Ooh, I like it. You got an attendant here, too. Lady yeah, Giga. Lady Giga, she's looking after the place. Very nice, very nice. I've moved the jukebox inside, too. Oh, sweet, sweet, sweet. Giga Tunes. Very good, mm -hmm. dude. Very good. And we even got a review book over here. All Take right. customer reviews. Giga Pie reviews. And, um, nice. Yeah, I mean, that's it. There's nothing re There's nothing more to the shop, really. That's about it. Very fancy. I mean, there's huh? a whole bunch of mess happening behind the shop. We got we got no stock. What's going on with here, man? Well, listen. <laughs> The one thing I didn't think about when I set up this uh, particular venture, Cub, is uh -huh. that it's actually a pain in the butt to make pumpkin pie uh, if you're doing a legit, you know. Okay, okay, yeah. You can use villagers. Obviously, that's the easiest way to get pumpkin pie. Bit of a uh, bit of a drop here, too, maybe? <laughs> yep, yep. Right. It's, um, it's a bit all unsafe right. back here. Okay, but yeah. Of course, <laughs> as you know. It's all right, yep. You can only have got? 16 eggs at a time, right? So you can only make 16 pie at a time. It's really annoying. Yeah, that's kind of rough, gonna be honest. Yeah. Whoa, there's a lot of yeah. eggs. <laughs> Man. Yeah, it's too Ooh. many. Yeah. Here's our current stock. Ah, okay. Large double, almost a large double chest. I'm still uh, still baking some new ones. I gave out a bunch of fresh samples now, so... Gotcha, gotcha. I can put in some time doing some crafting here uh, in, in the near Sweet future, dude. so... Help you out a little yeah. bit. Yep. Yeah, unfortunately, the pumpkins, there's a bottleneck with the pumpkins and the sugar cane. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> got eggs for days, though. Yep. Yep. That's sweet, dude. This is great. This is great. Yeah, man. So that's it. I mean, that's it. 
I'm gonna I'm gonna just grab a stack of gigapies here as a yeah, man, go for it. prepayment for future work, I guess. <laughs> there we go. Excellent. All right. If I, and if I ever see you eating golden carrots again, dude, I'm not gonna be angry. I'm just gonna be like crazy disappointed and yeah, sad. Yeah, that was that was like I said. I just I was meaning yeah. to burn them, you know, because we want to we want to have people only eating pies, right? That's that's our goal here. Well, I mean, it's, Cub, did you not know that it is the best food in the game? I mean, this is there's a Minecraft myth going around that golden carrots are the best food. Pumpkin pie is the best food. That's I the mean, first I've heard of it, but I already believe you. I already believe you. <laughs> we need to do an ex expose video, Cub. Yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly. Minecraft myths busted. Pumpkin pie, best food. <laughs> yeah, perfect, dude. Do we need uh? Do we need anything around here? Do we need like uh terraforming around here? Is there something oh, I can I so can do much. to help you out? Like, do we should we terraform this we area? So Make this under we, yeah, we have to, area. We nice. gotta terraform this whole place. I was thinking about maybe thing. putting like a dock yeah. in the front run, maybe like. Oh, dude, that would be so sick. I think that would be yes. kind of cool. Have that something in the sick. front to like complement the uh, the wheat farm we got going here now. Yeah, the wheat definitely, field. dude. Listen, we need something down there, like where all that disgusting wheat is, right? We, that, like we are basically polluting the the, the Hermosipi right now, dude. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. We got the sugar. Do we need the sugarcane farm still? Can I take that down? Move that. Yeah, we can get rid of that, man. Get rid of that. Yeah, put that. In, get a nice the... dock there in the Hermosipi, dude. Oh, yeah, I think that place going to be cooking. Yeah, yeah. That, that's a good. I think it's a good project for me to take on today. I think. Yeah. All right, sweet. I'll I mean, do, we, do we want to sell like um, coffee with our pies? Oh yeah, yeah, maybe. I mean, dude, dude, I got a really nice uh, set it and forget it cocoa bean farm. If we wanted to sell Ooh. cookies, we could we could sell cookies because we got I weed. I buy cookies though, cup. No cookies. You know, cookies go I mean, with the pie bad, though, dude. A terrible food though. Yeah. Bad food source. People don't know that though, dude. Dude, potions, fire resistance too, aka Java, coffee. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I thought you were going with the cookies, coffees, cake. Like, cook, <laughs> the three C's. The three staple foods. The three foods. C's? Yeah. Dude, I could easily live on cookies, coffees, and cake, man. Oh, <laughs> goodness. And pie, obviously. Okay, okay. So, I mean, should I get should I get some blaze rods? Do I go to the nether? I dude. I'm, I, this is just a suggestion. I'm just trying to th think of how we can expand the business, right? We need to sell things Dude, that like people I got will it. actually buy. I got it. I got it. I got it. A drive up. A, no, a boat up. A boat Ooh. up coffee shop. A boat up pumpkin and... Uh, a boat? A drive through pumpkin pie coffee extravaganza. Yes. Yes. Dude, it's genius. Because people are going it. up I'm and down it. the Mississippi like nobody's business. They can just sort of swing in, pick up some pie, pick up some Java, and get on their way. Exactly. Amazing. Exactly. That's how we got to do it, man. That's how we got to do it. So I think this is a fantastic idea. Down here, we're going to make a little area that's going to be like a little dock area here in the front. We'll get rid of this sugarcane farm. We'll beautify the area up a little bit. Uh, and I think it would be cool to have, like we talked with, with Ren, a drive through boat coffee shop underneath of the gigapies so i'm thinking if we extend this sort of cove here into the wall and underneath of the wheat farm area and then we connect it up via like a water canal with this area over here people could just boat through pick up their fresh coffee and then boat out the other side which i think would be really 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 cool so that is what we're going to try and do we'll obviously fully automate it we want to have freshly brewed coffee to players can watch as the coffee brews that'll be super cool so we'll have that uh going as well and we're gonna need things like blaze rods for the brewing stands and glowstone uh as well as things like magma cream and stuff for the uh the potions themselves so lots to do here so let's get to it
And just like that, we created some docks. Take a look, ladies and gentlemen. We got the docks here where players can park their boats and walk on up to the Gigapie factory right up there. We also added some utility blocks down here, some furnaces, some storage, some uh, crafting benches and such. And yeah, of course, the docks themselves here. We got one short dock and one long dock here. We also added some greenery around the area, decorated the rock a little bit with some tuff. So I think the area looks pretty sweet. And we're also planning on, like I said, a coffee shop inside of this area underneath the Giga Pies. So let me show you that. We'll hop into this boat and you can see the dock from the river here. Which, by the way, this river, this is a pretty deep river right here. Like, this goes down a long, long way. And as such, as you can see right there, there are a lot of drown that spawn, that spawn here. I actually picked up a trident while I was making these docks here. Uh, but, yeah. Basically, we're going to have the coffee shop inside of the river, or as part of the river here. So we need to make this a little bit deeper and a little bit wider, but this is the general idea. We're going to have a little area here where you can hop in here, jump out here. There'll be like probably something like over on this side here, maybe a little bit on this side as well. Uh, but you can buy potions and stuff in here, and then you can just boat on out the other side like that without ever having to... Yeah, be exposed to any danger, any mobs on the surface out here. So that should be pretty cool, but I'm very happy with the way the docks turned out for now. Um, so we got to actually go craft up some Giga Pies. We got to, told Ren I would do that, so we got to go put in some time to craft up some of these Giga Pies for the factory. All right, guys, so let's go ahead and do this. We'll gather up a bunch of eggs. We already crafted up a bunch of sugar from the sugar cane. Grab some pumpkins and should be able here to... Craft up a bunch of pumpkin pies, and then once we get at least one stack of pumpkin pie, we should then be able to rename it. And of course, we want to name it Giga Pies. Whoop, sorry, not Giga Pies, Giga Pies. There we go. And then TM, so just like that. There we go. Make sure it's the same. Yes, it is. All right. Giga Pie is created, and then we just do this exact same thing, so we will do this. But for now, guys, I think that is going to be it for me today. If you enjoyed today's episode, please leave a like, be sure to subscribe, and as always, thanks so much for watching, guys. This has been Cobb. Goodbye.